I now request our respected headmaster, Dr. Jayantapal, to kindly come up on the stage and say a few words. Good evening, Mrs. Srimal. Students, those who have come from the other schools, and my dear staff, it's a great honor on our part today to have Mr. Simmel with us. This year, we received the Sahitya Academy Award 2007 for his contribution to. Nepali language and literature. <coughs> Mr. Srimal, he retired from this institution in 2006. So it's a great honor for the school, for all of us, those who are present here, who has worked in this institution since 1977. And I do hope that today Mr. Srimal will enjoy the program which the children will present today. And I do hope that he will go back to his time when he was here in this school and used to take part in the concerts here actively and used to direct the dramas. So we are really honored 
to have you here even though we received this award in the month of january we are late it's a belated felicitation which we are going to give to mr srimal but we have a saying that it's better late than never today we thought that all of us we thought that this is the right occasion to honor him i would like to request mrs devika mangrathi to offer a shawl from all of us here in victoria school miss Memento to Mr. Stephen. To be to Mr. Stephen. Thank you, sir. You may take your seat. Now, from all of us, sheer pleasure and privilege to honor a man of distinction like you. We are overwhelmed by your achievement. The Sahitya Academy Award 2007 that has been conferred. upon you is an acknowledgement of your con contributions to the development and enrichment of nepali language and literature you brought glory for the school and we all revel in that we are proud of you sir please accept our heartiest congratulations we live in deeds not in years in thoughts not breath your thoughts and actions inspire us you are the guiding light and a source of inspiration for the present generation and will remain so for many generations to come not only are you an icon of nepali community and its literature but in approach and conduct you are truly universal you believe in and practice a cosmopolitan culture it is said that books only partially represent their authors the writer is always greater than his books it is very much true of you it is a wonderful experience to come across a person like you you are the simplicity personified truly humble and cordial your genial personality and good natured humor never fail to charm anyone we are fortunate to have you here as our friend philosopher and guide we at victoria all urge you to carry on with your literary and humanitarian work you have embarked on explore new horizons bring new hope and engage yourself in ever new creations we wish you a happy healthy and long life thanking you your sincerely the staff of victoria school
Dr. Jayantapa, my contemporary colleagues and junior master and their families, my beloved student, my regarded domestic staff, my regarded office staff, my good behaved regarded degree staff, those who have given me the love and their care during my school day, school day here. Today, when I'm here, I feel, when I see my colleagues here, I feel that I'm not retired. I'm here only. But it was very unfortunate when the age goes up, a person has to retire, he couldn't stay forever to, a, to any service. Though, today, I am very pleased to be here and to have with my friends. I must say, Victoria Boys School Kassing was not only connected with my service, but this school has given me ample of scope to push my literary career to the level of this day as Saita Academy Award winner. I used to get I used to get cooperation from my all colleagues. Almost in all the activities, I was never discussed in my cultural voice. While reading my chronological literary activities, I started writing poem and short story from early days of my school. And late Narayan Tam, I must take his name. Late Narayan Tam, who is my, my teacher, had give guide me in this stream as to make me creative writer. Thus my sincere devotion in the field of Nepali literature became evolution within me to serve my community. It was my dedication in form of discipline to write a continuous lead. I wrote poems, I wrote short stories, I wrote lyrics, I wrote criticism, but finally my writing, my writing has taken the turning point as a playwright. 
टू बी ए मैच्योर प्ले राइट एनुअल कंसर्ट हाउस कंसर्ट ऑफ विक्टोरिया बॉयज स्कूल फॉर द लास्ट ट्वेंटी ईयर हैज गिवन मी ए गुड अपॉर्चुनिटी मिस्टर एम एम भट्टाचार्यजी मिस्टर ए बैनर्जी मिस्टर जे दास गुप्ता लेटी सुनील भट्टाचार्यजी वर माई पार्टली सोर्स ऑफ इंस्पिरेशन and as well as mr d moktan to the dramatic atmosphere was at my home my father my brothers and my brothers in law was attached with the drama and their acting culture was a glimpse to me adding adding all this film and culture i must say that atmosphere of victoria boys school is an inspiring one for embarking the individual if the constructive food project is taken today i am here with you all as ex senior master this felicitation is most worthy one to a teacher who belong to victoria boys school i therefore thank you you all for inviting me here and giving me such a gracious felicitation and provided that i have been invited here in this auspicious occasion annual concert which was very much connected with me for my last 20 years 28 years so again i thanks yet master my colleague and student everyone who invited me here and given me such a felicitation which was i never respect people thank you again you to you all and i just one thing i would like to say if victoria boys school need my service i am ready to render in future day till i arrive thank you very much
잡기 동네 오이나 뭐또이나 원하게 나가지 갑자기 간서 갑자기 간서 앞으로 바바리 마수다 가대도 넘어가라 
Yeah. 
the cast Nitish Subha as Doctor, Anupam Lama as Ramri Maya, Pratik Dewan as Bal Singh, Rewas Pradhan as Dakshina, Kanaya Kumar as Bahun, Samip Century as Chakri, Galzan Wongdi Dukpa as Dole, Rajat Mukhya as Sadhu, and Ujjal Diyali as Champus. We now have a short intermission. We request all of you to please go to the store for some refreshment.
of Gelsberg in England. Life goes on at an easy pace in this quiet neighborhood, even on a Christmas night. They say, nothing ever happened here. That Christmas night, after the midday mass, the Greens have returned home and retired for the night, as nothing ever exciting happened in good heaven. So now we take you to the living room in the old house of the Greens in Galesburg, England. Younger brother. 
brother Arthur? If you try to pull my leg off, Sin is never pull people's leg. And I'm quite serious. Arthur is a wonderful fellow. Loves reading about him. And uh, he's only 13. I'm sure you'll like him. Your word of honor as a city that you call nobody else. My word of honor. A city never tells a lie. Okay, you may come. Please, please, please. Do not start till we are back. The night is still young. It wasn't 
you. The wolf, ah, and come to steal my Christmas presents. Amazing. Combination, quick. Or I'll blast you. Ha! 
By Jove, he will. But it doesn't matter. I'll get him another. His life is so monotonous. It'll be something for him to talk to his patients. Right, so Uncle Justin. You see? Solid steel is yelling to the fight of the drill. Good. I must get one. Might be useful. Where do you buy them? A professional secret, you know. But I could send you one. Please do, my dear brother Wolf.
something to talk about. Last.